What's up y'all, my name is Rhino Spartan, and I built a railgun that recharges in just under 4 seconds in Space Engineers. This contraption is based off of a jump drive contraption that grinds down the jump drive and welds up a fully recharged jump drive. I don't know what it's called, but that's what I based this contraption off of. It's very similar. It grinds down the railgun and then welds up a fully recharged railgun, so you can continue firing. It takes a minute to recharge, but instead, for this one, it takes four seconds. And it is also fully automated, and you can just fire it and push one button, and it's fully recharged in just four seconds. I accomplished this by using three timer blocks. And I haven't used timer blocks much in the past, but... I'm starting to get good with them. In the back here are some merge blocks so that when you actually build this contraption in survival mode, you can easily attach it to your ship. Keep in mind that the reactor is not included with this blueprint and it's mainly made to attach to a ship so it's going to take power off of, re of a, off of a ship's reactor. So. If I didn't have a reactor on this thing during the video, I wouldn't be able to fire it. So to actually use this contraption, you want to open the toolbar and set up an action for block weapons and select the railgun option. Next what you want to do is find the timer block that says start sequence and it starts the grinding and welding sequence. You want to go ahead and add that to your toolbar and select trigger, not start, trigger. That way, when you fire this thing, you can immediately just push another button and it starts recharging. Just like this. Pretty simple. Alright. Alright, let's get to, uh, destroying things with it. Instead of shooting at Red Ship, I decided to shoot at one of my own ships for a change. And... Fire. What? Oh dear. Oh dear. Goodness gracious me, what did I just do? I one-shotted my ship. Straight through the side. Oh, that's what I did. I, I, I knocked off the conveyor ports on each side of the, the ship, and now hydrogen is disabled throughout the entire ship. Wow. Okay, let's see how long it takes for a railgun to pierce through six layers of heavy armor blocks. Hopefully this won't take long. And just under 25 seconds. Wow, not too bad, not too bad. Not too bad at all. That's pretty cool. Not gonna lie, that's, that's pretty cool. Now, if you want to completely obliterate your enemies in Space Engineers, this thing is now available on the Steam Workshop. The Workshop link is down in the description. And if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a magnificent day. Bye-bye.